Everyday English phrases and expressions, Part Two, from EspressoEnglish.net. Here are seven more English phrases used in everyday life, with explanations and examples. Number one, no hard feelings. You can say this after someone apologizes to you for something serious. To express the fact that you won't stay angry. For example, if your friend made a rude remark that humiliated you, and the next day he says, "I'm really sorry. I shouldn't have said that. I feel terrible," you can answer, "That's okay. No hard feelings." To tell him you won't stay angry. Number two. The more the merrier. Say this to show that you are happy that more people are joining an activity. For example, you're going on a hiking trip with a friend, and three more friends want to go too. If they ask you, "Can we join you on the hike?" you can say, "Sure." The more the merrier. It means that a bigger group will be more fun. Number three, join the club. Say this when another person says something that applies to you too. It's usually a negative thing. For example, if your classmate says, "I have too much work to do," you can say, "Join the club." It means I have too much work too. Number four, no need. This phrase means it's not necessary. For example, if you're going home from work and you normally don't have a car, so your colleague says, "I'll give you a ride," you can say, "No need. My husband is picking me up today." It means it's not necessary to get a ride with your colleague. Number five. Now, where was I? Or. Now, where were we? Say this to get back on topic after an interruption or distraction. For example, you're helping your friend install a computer program, and you get a phone call. You answer it and talk for a few minutes, but then you forget what part of the installation process you were on. You can say, "Now, where were we?" Your friend can remind you. We installed the software, but we haven't registered it yet. And then you can continue. Oh, right. Click here to register. Number six. Just my luck. This is a sarcastic way to say that you are having bad luck. For example, you are single and you meet a great woman who you really like. But she's engaged to someone else. You can say, "Just my luck," because it was bad luck that you met a wonderful girl, but she's not available. Number seven, big deal. This is a sarcastic way to say that something, especially another person's accomplishment, isn't as important as it seems to be. For example. If a friend says, "Did you hear that Jeremy got a job with a two hundred thousand dollar a year salary?" you can say, "Big deal! He only got that job because his father is the president of the company." The phrase "big deal" means you think Jeremy's getting the job was not due to his skill or was not that great of an accomplishment. Thanks for watching English tips from Espresso English. If you liked this video, please share it.